Hey guys, what's up? Welcome. Today is a fusion full body workout. What do I mean by fusion? We're gonna combine elements of Pilates, bar, yoga, all into one amazing workout. Equipment today is a variety of weights. On the light side, I'm gonna be from three to five, a mat and your amazing body. If you're new to this channel, welcome. Do make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you do not miss any new workouts. We're gonna warm it up, roll your shoulders back, get yourself in second position. Carol, are you ready? Yes. I am ready. So just give a little shake into your hips. Find a little groove. We're gonna sweep down up, sumo squat. Down and reach. Two more, and then we're gonna turn to that right side and lunge, sweep down and up. Push through the front foot, arms by the ears when you reach it up. Other side, sweep up and over. Kind of flows nicely. Two more. Sumo squat, side leg lift, leg up. Other side. Now step it in, sweep in and up. Side leg lift, down and reach. Step in, woo, sumo squat and pulse. Reach the arms in T, open up that chest. Pull the belly up and in. Get a little lower if you can. Lunge it, sweep down and up. There it is. Big reach. Other side, up and over. Woo, drop, lift. All right, you guys, you get one more chance. Up and over lunge. Now add a little drama. Big reach, big push. Up and over. Four. Sumo, side lift. Drop and reach. Now step it in. Big reach up to the sky. Side lift. Okay, I want length. Pull it in. Sumo pulse, stay in reach. There it is. Make sure your knees track your toes. And go for a little more push to the back. All right, step to the front. Sun salutation to come to the ground. Inhale, reach. Dive. Half lift. Step or hop plank. Down dog. Plank. Down dog. Hold the plank, open the feet a little bit. Shoulder tap right, left. Right knee, left knee. Keep it coming, come on. Shoulders, knees. Woo. Warm up the arms, warm up your core. Drive it up, come on, shoulders, knees. Press through the heels of the hands, come on. Do it again. Last ones. Knees down, child. Woo. For this section, we got eight moves. We're gonna spend 50 seconds in each move with a 10 second transition. I'm gonna be using five, Carol's got eights. We're doing a swing with a tap out to the side. That is our first movement. Everything is low impact. Roll your shoulders back. Let me get my timer started here. All right. Remember, it's gonna be a tap out here. Tap and reach. Arms are staying straight. Palms can face down the entire time or you can rotate. If you want a little more intensity, a little tap. Pick up the feet. Remember, 50 seconds. If your back is sensitive, chest is higher. And how do you make this harder? Maybe you go heavier next time. This is gonna keep a steady state heart rate. Nice stretch out with that foot. And relax. 
Come over to the right side of your mat. We're taking over and over. You can add a punch. Shoulders back, step over, punch. You can make it a bigger movement. It could be a skater, but we're staying right here. Big lateral step out. It's either a punch or a reach. And you can see we have no shoes today, so that's optional. Helps me stay more grounded and more balanced. Keep those knees with a bend. Chest is up. Sumo. We're gonna drop and reach. Cross and up. Shoulders back, chest is up. Feet are turned out, go. Drop, reach. Now how low can you go? Depends on your body, your knees. All right, we're gonna do a little step in. We got two of these. Step right in, and then left. Now stay, don't go anywhere. Try it again. That is an option. Stay. Stay. Ooh. How about we just do the steps in? Let's turn up that heart rate. Bigger movements. Can you get your heels to come inward? One more. Great job. All right, curtsy lunge. Right foot stays. Left foot goes back. Drop. As you drop, can you reach? Drop, tap. If it's too much, stay with the weight in the front. Push your hip out. Makes it harder when you reach up as you drop down. Feel that, Carol? Yes. Push your hip out. If you got good balance, you can do a knee. Pull. Oh, yes. Shake it out. Oh my gosh, right? Let's switch the legs, roll it back. Get in your curtsy. Ready? Drop, tap. Okay, you gotta have that core turned on on this movement, right? Woo! Can you reach your arm? So, this is like a little reach. I know you could get big. Push your hip out. Find the balance if you want. The knee can come up. Oh my gosh, right? You could do this. 20 seconds. You thought I was gonna say like five, right? Inhale, exhale. Woo! Now you got five. That was really a long one, right? Lunge. Let's turn here. Right foot is forward. Left leg is back. I'm gonna drop and lift. Side raise. Try to get both legs at 90 degree angles. If the weight gets heavy, bend your elbows. Press into that front foot. Chin up. Hold it down. Bring the weight up, heels up. All you gotta do is hold for a moment and then start to pulse. And over the arms. You wanna just work on the legs, right? You feel your arms are getting too much. Just stay there. Come on, crank into the toes. Three, two, relax. 
Ooh, we're gonna stay facing this way. Catch your breath, switch the legs. Lunge and side lift, go. Bend both knees. Walk down low, come on. Oh yes. Push through that front foot. Now come here and hold. Toes, dig, heel is up, pulse. Go in, out. Oh yeah, the sweat's coming now, right? Chin up, abs in. Go for the burn, come on. Ooh, step in. Heels in, toes out. First position, if you need a chair, grab it. Heels are lifted, knees are bent. Palms are up. We're gonna scoop as we drop. Drop and scoop. Or lift, your choice. Make it big, we're gonna be making it small in a moment. Oh yeah. I'm struggling with the fives. Yeah. All right, bring it a pulse. Bring it up. Pulse. All right, drop another quarter of an inch or a half an inch. Heels together. Use your toes. Shoulders over your hips. You got 10 seconds. Woo. Four, three, two, one. Woo. Oh. Yes. Okay, take a little breather, get your water, towel off, and we're coming back with light weights. Our first move, we're gonna be in forearm plank. I'm gonna use three pound weights. So we hold on to the weights, knees or toes, and we're lifting the arm out to the side. So it's really important to have your feet open, tuck your tailbone, drop your hips a little bit here. Again, take the option if you wanna be on the knees. You could also be up on the hands, and you could do one and then the other. Come into your position. I decided to go into fives. <laughs> Side lift and switch. Now, again, it's really important to make sure that you have your feet open. If you're in that forearm plank, Carol's got a great option if you want. Oh, Carol, don't move your hips though. Try to keep everything facing down. So open the feet up or the knees up wider. See, I can catch you out of the corner of my eye. And if it feels like it's too fast, hey, go to your tempo. Again, shoulders and hips shine down. Getting into the rear delt, great for posture. Pull up and in. Plank. Whew. Okay, one weight. I'm gonna be on my knees. Shifting forward, palm faces back, press. So in this position, I got that arm on the floor working, then the arm is doing a tricep press back. It's straight back there, right? Look out in front. I'm using five. Pull your head back. Now, kick back. Kicks, quick. Turn the shoulders and hips, please. All right, look out in front. Ooh, this is gonna be tough on the other arm. It's already working, come on. Five. Relax. Ooh, we're dying here today. Okay, let's switch the arms, shake them out. Other side. Bring it back. So in this press back, right, the hips come down. I'm leaning into the arm that's on the floor and then keeping the working arm with the weight straight. 
pressing it up and back behind my hip. Pull up and in. Woo. Now kick back. Push. Quick. You can make your feet pretty. You can pull the heels into your butt. You can lengthen your spine even more. You could also do this standing. Oh my gosh, Carol's awfully quiet there. <laughs> Three, two, and one, release. Ooh. Come on to your knees, we got overhead extension. I'm gonna stay with fives. Weight is up, press it up. Now on the knees, what I want you to do is I want you to kind of lean back a little bit, push your hips to me. Squeezing up and in on the way to the top. Let the weight kind of rest into the heel of your hand. I go out wide and then narrow. If you want a little bit more, just lean back just that tiny bit. You guys, you got 10 seconds. Woo, reverse fly. Come on onto your feet. I gotta wipe the sweat out of my eyes. So we're gonna do a reverse fly. Pull it up to shoulder height. Now there's an option. You can go pinky out, thumb is in. Tee the arms. Try to get to that shoulder height. Pinch between the shoulder blades. So good for your posture. All right, I want you to bend the elbows. Hold it right here, your little pulses back. Pinch back. Now keep the arms here, but turn the palms to face inward. Open it up. Turn back. Turn in. Turn back. Relax. Woo, seated. Come on down to your ground. And we're gonna take a little reach here. You're gonna reach, open, close, come in. You reach, open, close, hold the weights to the hips. If you have a little mini ball, it could go into your low back or a pillow if you need it. <sighs> Grow tall when you come up. Kind of tuck under when you go down. Ooh, come on. Reach, open. So you get that shoulder, you get that bicep. Got three seconds. All right, Carol, spin the legs around so you can see what's going to go on. I'm gonna grab my threes. Ooh. Crisscross. Right there. All right, tuck under, lean back. You can have the palms face any direction that you want to. All right, now come down here. Curl, release. Option, kick. So when you're in this workout, right, you gotta keep your mind right where you are or you're gonna lose what you're doing and not get as much out of the workout. Big squeeze, come on. Single leg bridge, scoot your body forward. All right, arms are up. Extend one leg, and then I'm gonna reach back, drop the hips, and lift it up. Go to tempo, down and lift. Inhale, exhale. So we gotta pull over in a single leg bridge. Can you see me shine? 
shaking Hear the sound of my heart breaking a little bit focus on the inside of the foot that's on the floor to help you to get more out of your glute. All right, relax. Ooh, okay, we're switching legs. And then this time, take the arms into T. Down with the hips, and then up with the arms and hips. Here we go. Drop, lift. Keep it going. We may have had more than eight moves. <laughs> That's okay. Keep it going. I'll look at the clock. Again, focus a little bit on the inside of your foot here. Give me two more. Don't you feel the time? And relax. All right, waist go down. Just do a little knee sway. And this is where we're going to take a little break. So get some water, towel off, and we're going to flip around for the 100. Come on down. We got the 100. Knees in. Extend the legs. Start to pump the arms vigorously up and down. Breath can be inhale, two, three, four, exhale. So we bring the head up and in. And if you need some support, a hand can go behind. You can also bend the knees. Hey, you can take the feet down to the floor if you need to. And if you want to level up, lower it down and squeeze and lengthen out even more. Eyes are on the thighs. All right, release. Reaching arm to opposite foot. We'll do half one side and then switch. Hand behind the head, long leg, squeeze the thigh. Take it up, reach. Try to go to the outside of the foot. Get up and over. All right, I need you to just straighten the leg a little bit more. Kick a little bit higher. Switch. I can feel it coming. You on my radio. All I'm hearing is a song. All right, good neck support. All right, have that, those fingers right in that little groove. The back of your neck. Side forearm plank. up down kick drop kick let's go so the option two you stay down right there still work it try to really lengthen out so I feel like you're pushing something away hold it now option Reach, front. Now, if you want to, pick up that knee off the floor, or you can just keep it down, totally works. Come on, one more. All right, swing it around. Whew, side form plank. Okay, do that clam and kick. All right, are you ready? 
Here we go. Kick out, bring in. All right, hold it out. Hold that crunch to the side. And take your option. Ooh, or fall, right? But with grace. Turn it on to all four. Yes. Ooh. Pick up that front leg. Up, cross back. Lift and cross. So this is our donkey cross. And again, flexing the foot, pressing through the heels of the hands. Pull the head back, press through the heels. Take it up, just pulse, hold up, to stay. Make sure your knee is shining down. Pull the head back again just a little bit. Relax. All right, other side. Find where those knees need to be, just slightly open. Leg is up, cross, cross and lift. So you're tucking that knee back and squeezing the glute at the top. Up, hold, now pulse. Belly up and in, shoulders down. And release. Now this one gets a little confusing. You get a side kick to the front, settle into the toes, and single dog with the back leg. Kick front. Kick, single dog. So you have to be gentle on the knees when they come down. Kick, single dog. And you can even just stay on the knees. One kick, kick front, one kick, kick back. Look at Carolyn hit me in the face. She's got long legs. Let's do the other side. I kind of felt it. Back leg. See the back. Let's do it. Back. Single dog. Lots of great movement. This actually feels really good. What do you think? You guys liking it? Ooh. Keep dancing in the moonlight. The shadows cover up my sins. Always smile when in hindsight. Ooh, relax. Oh, nice job. Shift back, just take a breather here. Don't get anything done, you stuck on my mind. I keep 
pull forward into cobra, so drop into your elbows. Or sphinx actually lengthen up here. Ooh. And then press into the hands, give me up dog. Push into down dog. Walk the dog a little bit here. Both heels pressed down. Soften the knees. Step it to the front. Inhale, reach it up. Dive it. Half lift. Step or hop into your plank. Give me a chaturanga. Up dog. Down dog. Step or hop to the front. Let's do one more of those. Fan out. Dive. Half lift, step or hop plank, chaturanga, up dog, down dog, hold, step to the front, roll it up. Nice job. Whew. We're going to do a little yoga flow here to kind of finish you off. Roll the shoulders back, fan up. Dive, half lift, step into your plank, single dog, right leg is up, hold. Elbow sweep, left, right, hold it up. Elbow sweeps, or you can just hold that single dog one more time. All right, we're gonna flip it. Take that leg back behind you, drop the hips, lift the hips and reach. A little wild thing here, down with the hips. Lift and reach. Two more. Hold. Step it front, lunge, please. Hold. And then add a twist. So open up to that side. Sink in your hips. Pyramid, we're gonna step the back foot in. Lengthen out in front. Now, hands can be on the shin, but if you've got that flexibility, bring the fingers or the palms to the ground and then pull your spine out of your hips here. Take it to the back lunge and then front lunge to the back. So just kind of shifting in the hips here. to the front, low lunge, and then half moon. Hand goes out on the right, open up the left, lift away from the ground, maybe flex the top foot, pull the belly up and in. Low lunge for a moment, and then pull it into a little warrior three. Lift up and hold. Drop into the lunge, maybe you can pray, and then lift here. Hold. Hands down, same leg, right leg, single dog, hold it. Elbow sweep. Do it again, single dog, to the elbow sweep. Let's do two more of those. Let's stretch it back. We're flipping it, wild thing, drop it back. And then lift and open up the front of your body. Do it again, we release and we lift. Keep the lift, step the foot forward and lunge, pause. And then open up into a twist. Settle in the hip, stay here. Girl, I see your face everywhere. When I'm going out, you'll be there. Cause everything reminds me of you. I Bring it in for that pyramid. So pull the back foot in. Girl, Shoulders and hips square out. Find where you need to be. Keep like you. Stay in that pyramid a little longer. Pull out. Your touch from your hands and your body. It hurts so 
All right, take it to the back lunge, so open up the legs, back, then move to the front. Roll the shoulders back. Couple more here. Lift your chin up, hold front. Spin into that low lunge for a moment. Hand goes down for that half moon. Stay there and try to lift out of the floor. Right, so lift up and in. Sink and lunge for a moment. And then when you're ready to, you're gonna soar to that warrior three. Reach it up. Try it again, pray lunge, and then reach. Hold, stay there, hold it, hold it. All right, step front, take this foot, cross it back, and then reach it up. Front, sun cell, we're moving to the other side, reach it up. Dive, half lift, step or hop into your plank, hold. Single dog, left leg is up. Just stay with that leg up there. Press through the hands. Elbow sweep, right, left. Single dog. Sweep again. You're gonna do two more. We're getting to flip here. Bend the knee, drop the hips back. Whoops. Drop. And lift. So lower the hips. Blade and ball. Two more. Oh my gosh, feels so good to open up the front of the body. Hold the lift. All right, return with that throat in the front and then add a twist. Push through the bottom arm and really open up and look to that arm to the top. Pyramid, so pull the back foot in. Find where you need to be. Couple of deep breaths here. Lunge it to the back, to the front. Just keep it shifting. Do it again to the back, to the front. Hold, lunge and lift into that half moon. Again, try to lift a little bit off the floor. We're gonna drop in that lunge for a moment. Hold. Warrior three. Ooh, yeah. Good thing Carol's here. She's got you. Lunge here for a moment. Pray. Warrior three, reach. <laughs> All right, take it down. Release. Single dog. Elbow sweep. Single dog. One more time. Getting ready to flip, bend the knee, drop the hips, drop and lift. Drop and lift. Hold. Do it again, drop here. Up, hold. Let's do it one more time. Spin it in front, lunge. We're gonna pull it back in for that pyramid. Bring it in. Give me more length. Pull something in, reach something a little bit further out. All right, lunge it to the back. Walk to the back, to the front. 
shoulders roll back, lengthen that chest. You can always lift the toes and go into the heels. Hold in the front. Lunge, half moon, open. All right, can you lift a little bit? A little lunge, pause. Warrior three, hold. Stay with that warrior position there. Try it again, drop in the lunge, and then lift and hold. Ooh. Step front, cross that right leg behind, and side stretch. Open up the chest, kind of reach back a little bit. Release, roll the shoulders. All right. Let's finish this off. Just a nice little breather. Roll it back. Shut your eyes for a moment. This is good just to ground your feet. Be grateful to that body. Big inhale, sweep it out, reach it up. Pull it into your heart. Behind the head, open the chest. Release, relax. Let's do one more of those. Big inhale, reach it up. Pull it down. Behind the head. Open the feet up wider than your mat and just fall it forward. Grab your elbows. Great time to just shut your eyes and just let the arms and your upper body kind of sway a little bit. Settle the hands down, walk the feet in, and then when you're ready to roll it up. Big inhale, reach it out, reach it up. Pull it into your heart. One more time, have the gratitude grateful to you. Put your hand on your heart. Ah, grateful to you guys for coming, working out with us and my girl Carol. Nice job. Thank you. You, if you enjoyed this workout, make sure you do thumb it up, share this with a friend and make sure if you're not subscribed to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. So you do not miss any workouts. You guys, we will see you back on the mat again. Take care. Bye. Nice job, woo, good to have you. Ah, oh, it was sweaty. We're done, that's it.